hello everyone welcome back to my channel here we have one problem so in this problem we have to find x value so let's see square root of 20 square root of 20 square root of 20 equal to 400 uh, to the power of x so we can write it as square root of 20 square root of under square root of 20 in square root of square root of square root of 20 so first one has only one square root and second one has two square roots third one has three square roots so equal to 400 to the power of x so 20 to the power of 1 by 2 we can write it as like this so 20 to the power of 1 by 2 to the power of 1 by 2 because it has two square roots sin 20 to the power of 1 by 2 whole to the power of 1 by 2 and whole to the power of 1 by 2 so it has 3 square roots so 400 equal to 400 to the power of x so now 20 to the power of 1 by 2 and 20 to the power of 1 by 2 times 1 by 2 which is equal to 20 to the power of 1 by 4 1 by 2 times 1 by 2 2 times 2 4 1 by 4 and third one 1 by 2 times 1 by 2 1 by 2 times 1 by 2 times 1 by 2 2 times 2 4 4 times 2 8 so 1 by 8 1 by 2 times 1 by 2 times 1 by 2 which is equal to 1 by 8 20 to the power of 1 by 8 equal to 400 to the power of x and next a to the power of x times a to the power of y times a to the power of z equal to a to the power of x plus y plus z this is the formula i am going to apply this formula here so 20 to the power of 1 by 2 plus 1 by 4 so plus 1 by 8 equal to 400 to the power of x so now we have to add all these three fractions so let's say 1 by 2 plus 1 by 4 plus 1 by 8 first add these two numbers so 1 by 2 just multiply this 1 by 1 times 4 4 and again multiply this 2 times 4 2 times 1 plus 2 so multiply this 2 times 4 8 so 6 6 divided by 8 plus 1 by 8 now add this 2 fractions so, so 6 times 8 48 plus 8 times 1 8 divided by 8 times 8 times 8 64 equal to so 48 plus 8 56 divided by 64 so 8 times 8 8 7 times 56 7 by divided by 8 so 20 to the power of 7 divided by 8 so now 400 400 we can write it as 20 square whole to the power of x so 20 to the power of 7 divided by 8 equal to 20 2 times x 2x 20 to the power of 2x so here we have same basis so basis are same so exponents are different so we have to say take only exponents and that is 2x equal to 7 divided by 8 so x equal to 2 comes down so it's 1 by 2 times 7 by 8 so x equal to so 7 1 times 7 2 times 8 16 so x equal to 16 let's verify so 
the square root of 20 square root of 20 on the square root of 20 so equal to 400 to the power of x x equal to 7 divided by 16 so so we know the calculation of this so we can or write it as uh, we can write directly so that is 20 to the power of 7 divided by 8 equal to 400 to the power of x and 20 to the power of 7 divided by 8 equal to 400 we can write it as 20 square whole to the power of x so 20 7 by 8 so 2 times x 20 to the power of 2x so now 20 to the power of 7 divided by 8 equal to 20 square so x place so we have to here we have to put this x value in this we have to substitute x value so that is 7 divided by 16 so this is the x value so so 2 times 8 16 20 to the power of 7 divided by 8 equal to 27 to the power of divided by 7 by 8 so this this is the correct answer x equal to 7 divided by 16 so this is the x value thank you for watching if you like this video please do subscribe like and share thank you for watching